Well, good day, tubes. Think it's morning? I don't know. Come on, buddy. There you go. We were up at the uh, ooh, racetrack last night, uh, Varney Speedway there, and uh, she was a late night, <laughs> let me tell you. And this is actually the last weekend for the races, so they're going to have uh, another one tonight. And it's actually uh, my wife's uncle who used to race up there for many, 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 many years. He passed away. He's actually buried back here. Um, it's a memorial race for him, 50 lap memorial race. So, but. Uh, Anyways, uh, she was a late night last night. I don't know. They had so many cautions, you know, which takes forever each one. So I think we got home. It was, oh, oh man, darn near almost one o'clock. I do believe. I can't even remember now. It's, <laughs> you know, then boom, I got to be up before eight o'clock to get her open the gate, right? So she's uh, she's been along. A long day with not much sleep and she's gonna be like that again tonight so I'm just gonna be totally wrecked tomorrow but um, maybe I can grab a quick nap or something this afternoon sometime but anyhow enough of that crap um, the uh, video I put up the other day there on the bridge when we were building that first bridge um, oh, someone's got his bike going uh, building the first bridge and uh, of course you know now it's all tore out and stuff because some knob drove over with the big tractor thought it would hold up and yeah it didn't so you know, but uh, actually, uh, Iron Daddy's on his way down now. Uh, if you know Iron Man, check out Iron Man's channel there. He's a pretty freaking awesome guy, I'll tell you. Iron Man is on his way down there, uh, down here now, with um, some I beams for the new bridge project. And uh, <clears throat> hopefully, this uh, new bridge project will be commencing soon. And uh, anyways. I got a couple of ways he's bringing down on his trailer. <clears throat> I think he's bringing four 13 footers down on his trailer. So, um, 13 foot isn't quite wide enough. We needed, uh, I think, 20, but he says, ah, I couldn't find 20. So, I guess whenever they're cutting them out of whatever these uh, buildings or whatever, they're chopping them down too, right? To fit them on a truck. So, <clears throat> pardon me. But anyways, he's going to bring four of them down for me, so we're going to have to uh, get them unloaded off his trailer. And uh, uh, I want to switch buckets on the tractor here. Put my 24-inch on with the uh, with the thumb, so I can just kind of reach onto his trailer, pick it up, and then away with it, right? The other ladder, we're going to have to get straps out and stuff, and strap it. Well, the thumb's a lot nicer. You can just grab it gone right so let's go uh, let's go do that we'll go change buckets and uh, put the thumb on and uh, wait for arrival of Iron Daddy or Iron Man I call him too I call him Iron Daddy because you know like sugar daddy Iron Daddy you know like he's so good to me he's like a sugar daddy but he's a Iron Daddy and stuff like that so <laughs> he's gonna laugh over that <laughs> I can just tell are you laughing buddy <laughs> but anyway, so let's head her down. Dilly's gonna do some riding on the topsoil. I'm messing around down here, waiting for Iron Man and stuff. So uh, hopefully he checked his gas, because you know he might be almost running on fumes. I don't know. So, but anyway, so let's head her down. We'll change a bucket here. Well, first things first, we gotta get this big, big feller pulled off. So. Side against now. Yeah, I'm on 
pretty grimy. Yeah. Uh, we can, I guess, hook up the other pin here. So at least we get our curl back. Something like that. off and then we can start uh, that's the real dirty stuff then we can start putting the, the cylinder on for the for the rim or for the, the thumb okay so this is fun <laughs> it's not bad I don't really think I needed one quite so big but that's okay what we got <sighs> I usually try to hang it on the tractor here first. On the uh, Dewey there. They're a bit of a nightmare. Oh, I like this one's gonna be. Uh, don't mind my butt. Sometimes I can get this side in. These fittings are weird on these things. I don't know. I'm super crazy on them because of any sort of pressure in the lines. Yeah, you're not getting them on. Ah, so close so far. Okay, we're gonna have to stretch right a bit. Try to relieve the pressure on this thing here with just manipulating the dewies, and then I don't know if it's going to work. But sometimes these uh, oh, these fittings are just a nightmare. Oh, I got it! And if the tractor's cold, like wintertime cold, yeah, there's no way you're getting it off. You have to uh, pretty much undo it right here and then shove them on. Oh, I got it though. I got her. Okay, now we got to uh, pull her back up so we can get her hooked. So we can get her hooked. And uh, we should be good.
on the shot here. Oh yeah, pretty good. We are mounted, and uh, we're going to use that, of course, to uh, unload the uh, I beams. Iron Man gets here; shouldn't be too, too much longer. And uh, probably later or this week, sometime coming, I got some uh, bushes and trees and shrubs around some of these plots that people aren't looking after. So I'll go in and look after them, if you know what I mean. Rip gone, just like pulling a pulling a rotten old tooth out. Out she goes, so yeah, she's good. We'll wait for Iron Man and uh, we'll shoot him a bunch when he gets here. Oh, yeah, remember the can of spray I put up there? Oops, <laughs> forgot. I forgot. I forgot. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> oh I think I got her, boys. Oh. That's actually maybe a good spot to keep a can of lube down in there. Well, she got a little bit uh, squash, but that'll just in, not much left in there anyways. But that'll just increase the can pressure and just go whoosh, more when you when you juice her. So, uh, what's going on here now? That's supposed to be up there, Marner. Yeah. There we go. Now we're ready. Oh, hey, that would have been uh, pretty cool if that was a full can and it exploded, eh? Oh well. Do a wheelie. <laughs> you gotta sit back more and uh, yourself down. Just as you juice it. There you go. Oh, no better. <laughs> Do a wheelie. Oh, kid's crazy. I never done stuff like that when I was that age. Holy. Nine years old on a bike like that. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Do it again, I'll get a better view. Nice. <laughs> what happened? Did you crash? Now you can't get it up. Oh dear. What'd you do? And you fell. Boom, 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 down you went. Oh dear. There you go. You got her? Don't let her get away on you. You got dirt all over you now. Holy. It's gonna start now. Uh oh. You might have flooded her. And you got dirt all in her. See if she'll start up now. Keep it going. Keep going. Oh, I think we flooded her. Mm-mm. Oh, maybe. Hey! Nice. Are you okay? You didn't hurt yourself? No. Oh, hey. Do a wheelie. <laughs> wheelie. All right, so Iron Man just texted me there, said he'll be here in like 10 minutes to stop to the Timmy's. And uh, she'll be here momentarily. So anyways, we'll uh, shoot some Iron Man when he gets here. Oh, he brought the big dodge today. Holy crap. Can't believe it. 
and he got he got brought in by by the stinky man. Hey, buddy, that's Is not that a that's not a GMC you're driving there. Hey, hey. <laughs> I'm turning around and going home. <laughs> Holy, what did he bring me today? Oh, these weren't shifting around on you, were they? Ah, uh, yeah. A little bit. Holy. Got more straps. Oh no way! I'm gonna oh, yeah. I'm gonna owe you some straps too, aren't I? Holy. Okay, Mr. Smarty Pants with the, okay. we're What's not up? driving a GMC, look what I got. What'd you get? Bite me. <laughs> that goes in my trailer hitch receiver. Oh, that's so I funny. I meant to show you that last time. I gotta get show that. Remove to tow Chevy's. Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> you wanna just oh. my dodge. Come <laughs> on, do we? Oh, look at these I-beams. Oh man, we'll be able to drive a tank over this bridge. Holy. <laughs> that's gonna be awesome. Yeah, I cut this one. Looks like it's oh, going again. Starting to rub again. I totally lost that one back there. That's a oh, strap. I'm glad I brought spares. Holy snapping, eh? Look at my tree. Look what I did when you set it down with the crane. Crunch. <laughs> oh, jeez. I had to slam them boards in there. Oh, man. I screwed them all together. Holy and... crap. <laughs> That's freaking insane. That's not like super thin stuff either. That's pretty thick stuff. So, yeah. Holy. I got some repairing to do. Yeah, geez. Oh, well. That's a removable thing too, isn't it? Well, it's supposed to pull so it down, off. but my brother mounted the spare here. Oh, so it doesn't fall down. And I told now. him to mount it on the side, and it's supposed to pull down so you can get actually ah. get 12 feet oh, on here, right. right? Yeah. Holy. You know any guy that's got any iron that can, you know, you know, put some on your trailer for you? Um, I know a guy. Maybe. <laughs> it's my dad, Iron Dad. <laughs> iron Dad. That was funny when I saw that. Figured you like that. <laughs> Oh, at least so. I wonder if I can. So what I was thinking, hmm. I think they're like 13 feet and change. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If yep. you plasma cut along here, yep, and here, yeah, and then do the same here on the inside and so sort of overlap. This, so you cut this out, right? Yeah, section out. Yeah. So then you can put them in like that and kind of weld them here, <laughs> along here, and then maybe yeah. plug weld them. Yeah, that'd be and perfect. Well, oh, that'd they'll... be strong. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be a lot strong. Oh yeah. yeah. Holy. So did you torch these? Yep. You torched those. Yep. Holy cow. So what length were they to begin with? They were joined together. Oh, really? So they come out of a bridge or something, or a building, uh, I, or... Yeah, I think they came out of like a building or something. Oh, yeah, they got stuff welded on here, too. Yeah. Probably for holding rafter joisty or things, or... Put it down, whatever, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, we can <coughs> buzz those off pretty quick. But see, the other ones I had for you were taller this way, oh. but skinnier this way, and oh, a lot lighter material. Oh, yeah, these That's would be... That's why I was saying maybe we'll just be throw some... Yeah. Gussets in between. Yeah, the, yeah. Hold them I together. I don't think you're going to need that with these. No, those are going to be wicked strong. Yeah. <laughs> Holy jeez. Yeah. Like I say, you could drive a tank over them. Yeah. Holy. Well. Now make sure you place them wide enough for the tires of the loader, Bill. Well, if we go over with this. <laughs> we don't <laughs> don't necessarily have to. It was just an experiment. So, but yeah. Anyways. Okay. Uh, I think it'll be wide enough. Yeah, or it should be good. strong enough, I mean. Oh, yeah. Jeez. Yeah. Oh, God. Drive a tank over them. <laughs> Mr. Wheelie King here. I know, I eh? Holy jeez. Just taking that thing like a freaking fish to water, man. He's doing well, I'm yeah. Impressed. Yeah. He is doing well. Holy. Yeah, I imagine they had uh, probably cross things Something going across it, yeah. them. Yeah. Yeah, hanging on there. That's pretty cool. Okay, well, let's get set up. We'll get unloading these things. Okay, here we go. We're going to try to do it on one scoop. Maybe. Maybe.
<laughs> well, we kind of secured our deweys here for um, for today and tonight and probably tomorrow. Um, there is uh, what should I call them? Scrap metal iron thieves around here that have helped themselves to a few of my little things that I've left outside by mistake. Enough said about that, but anyways, uh, yeah, I had, uh, when we did the car, we put all the new bearings and stuff, and uh, brakes, and, you know, rotors, and all that stuff on it before we went out east there. I left it all sitting sort of up beside the garage, just going to take it out of scrap. Come, come uh, in, I guess it was on a Monday, gone! I'm like, wow, really? So someone's seen it sitting there, you know, snooping around, and stole her, stole her on me, so I kind of doubt they'd be able to pick one of these up. But, you know, if you had two, three guys, just, well, we wouldn't uh, be long, they'd be gone. But anyways, um, thank you, Iron Man, for bringing these. He's left, by the way. They had to go, so we're, we got to go, too. We got to go uh, up to the races again tonight, and I'm dark. Hey! Uh, up to the races again tonight. This is the very last night, so probably not going to uh, film anything, because they never seem to go over too well, so, you know. Some of you, I guess, or a lot of you, aren't uh, super interested in the racing. You know, it's, it's different. I, I, I can understand if you're not there watching it and you're watching it on, like, a TV thing, like on the YouTube or whatever. It's not quite as interesting as actually being there, right? So I understand that. But, uh, yeah, we're just going to go up and enjoy the last night. This is the last night of the year for up there. So I don't think they'll be able to sneak anything out if they did come and, you know, looking around. But holy snapping, this is going to be freaking strong! Now I got to think of a something to 
put this way across on the land probably just going to use uh oh, i'd like to pour like cement piri things there but man i better not go that far pardon me but that would be superior but i'm kind of thinking of just you know some more logs or something or something like that that'll kind of settle into the to the mush of the hill right i got logs over there i can't use the ones we ripped out so maybe we'll do something like that but uh I'm not 100% exactly sure when we're going to be getting to this project, but uh, should be uh, getting on her soon though because the winter is going to be here soon too. But then I got leaves that are starting to turn and they're starting to fall and starting to make a mess and so yeah, you know what's going to happen. I'll be getting busy with that and then the snow will start flying. And <laughs> but um, yeah, like I was saying, these aren't uh, quite long enough to, uh, let's just measure here. They said 13 feet apiece, so one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. I'd say at 13, my, my ones are a bit longer than, than normal, so. But uh, yeah, we're gonna have to, uh, I think it's 20 feet as a safe span from one side to the other. So we're gonna have to uh, do some uh, plasma cutting, welding, and fitting, and kind of join pieces to pieces, right? Um, should be a pretty interesting project to do um, so I'm not exactly a hundred percent sure how I'm gonna do it yet but we're going to uh, kind of join them together like a what do you call it where you know two things motion and then you can do some plug welding and stuff and and uh, overlap stuff and then we'll see how that looks I might even do like plates you know to go over kind of thing too right or something I don't know we'll figure something out but uh, yeah but anyways I guess for today that's gonna be her we got to get rocking here so we're uh, we'll head her in and uh, go check out some races tonight and uh, hopefully talk to you tomorrow uh, I don't know what I got planned for tomorrow maybe maybe doing a bit of cleaning up on these things because you know there's pieces there like we got to get off and stuff you know and smooth her off and stuff and get her back to the I-beams these must have been on holding other things or something too right so yeah, but we'll get those cleaned off and uh, we'll have a bit of scrap more metal too. Sweet! But uh, yeah, so anyways, we'll talk to you guys tomorrow. And have a good day. Sorry I'm dark again, but I'll talk to you tomorrow. Have a good day, thanks for watching.